together, shall we? Robert it's Flores, bad. Mark Rosa, I'm Laura Sadi. It's not bad. Our producer in our ear, before we came on camera, says, all right, guys, let's be better than D. Rose's suit today. <laughs> Oh, dis I see. disagree. I mean, I know That's... navy blue is probably my color. Gosh, if you like runs, yesterday was for you, huh? Uh, 21 whatever. for the Dodgers. Uh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> for the Red Sox is Friday. It is Friday. You want to know why I love the game? A couple different reasons. We like... had Archie Bradley on. He told you why. I why? forget what he said. What did he say? He said he's got a sweet, like, come out song and, and the good video board, and he doesn't want to be in the... Let's go three up, three down. Get the boys back in the dugout. Then you take a nap. You know why <laughs> I love the game? <laughs> Tell me. Something chipper to get down. Rick and Keel's thinking about, about making a, a comeback. comeback. Wow. Adam LaRoche is picking and grinning at first. You know, I think I, I need a couple days, days off next year and try and play in that. Okay. Yeah, we'll we can if, if, if they'll have if they'll from have location. me. If they'll have me. But it, and let's talk. Me and you have decided we're going on a health kick, two-month yeah. health kick. That's right. Rob, you in? If I'm going to be honest with you. I've had like 40 years of that. Let's do it. We'll, we'll track our progress. See no, October, no. October 1st. <laughs> anyone Bang, right that? here. Uh. Wow. All right, so, God, so that was a... If Jock Peterson's going to hit like this well, in, in October, because he had a great postseason run, I mean, their lineup just has no quit in it. Listen, we didn't expect Cody Bellinger... I think this is funny. Last year at this time, later on, if there's a waiver claim somewhere, I think we take for granted they were able to pick up Singrani, Watson. There was a lot of moves last year in that bullpen. We were able to take out Rich Hill in the fourth inning of a World Series game and feel good about it. Whether it was the right decision or wrong decision, he made it without even second-guessing himself. I don't think he can say he can honestly make that same move. They don't have the Brent Start Holy a series God. with your Astros. Start yeah. yeah, it's going to be good. They played a seven-game series. Jock Peterson, big night. Dodgers-Astros seven-game series now. Stop saying Come this. On, Colors could become your seventh, eighth guy. Charlie Morton's a guy for me that if Keiko happens to hiccup in the second inning, guess who goes six and a third for me? Charlie Morton's a guy I would bring in and leave in. Yeah. I don't say the same with McCullers because I think he's got weapons all over the place, but... AJ Hinch has done that before with Morton, I would say obviously. I would say Houston. <laughs> I need him healthy, though. Yeah. Uh, I believe Carlos Correa began his rehab assignment yesterday. More at the deadline, there are under-the-radar moves that work, and we love on what the Yankees and Brian Cashman, yeah. the Dodgers did. David Dang. Dabrowski made a couple, maybe not the sexiest moves. They're all paying off already. Lauren, you're you're a hundred percent right, and we can dive right in because I think he had a checklist for, checklist for, yep. with the little Fu Manchu with the little of this, <laughs> and it all works. Not the bleach tips. Anyone, any no. man who sits with tinfoil in their hair in a salon, that, is, that's a very difficult. You're the problem. No, that, it looks good for no, some people. No, you're the problem. Frosted no, it looks tips. Good for some no, some. People. Okay, I get it if you're going with the, but like who? If As you're a just rule. dying. Who have you tip, seen? No, no. Why is that your all go-to line always? You, Justin you would be with a guy who wore tinfoil in their hair at the salon. You walked in, and That's your a guy. Question. Uh, exactly. Some people look good with hey, it. Hey, what's up, honey? No, I just got 20 minutes. Okay. <laughs> what are Hold you talking on. About? I want to make a point about Justin Steve Timberlake. Pierce. Go ahead. No, not Justin Timberlake, who nails it, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Steve Pierce. Since the start of 2005, is, is, we weren't even talking about him. We were talking about Astrubal Cabrera, Eduardo Escobar, uh, Brian Dozier. Kins is the perfect guy. Pierce to go with Moreland. Evaldi, you know, kind of that hybrid. So this is pretty interesting. And the whole game yesterday was just so interesting. I know Aaron Boone's probably taking some heat. Well, Severino tonight, right? Yes, and Porcello. Who's been who's been bad his last four starts. How exciting is the postseason going to be in the American League? Mm. It's Can't gonna, wait for it's it. It's going to be a bloodbath. Here is your schedule. Trade deadline. Good morning to you. Chris Archer makes his first start for the Pirates tonight. New team, new uniform. We tweeted out that he was looking for a new coffee shop, so he's getting adjusted uh, <laughs> to his new digs. What are you looking for from him tonight, JP? to that team in that rotation near the top of that division of the Brewers. They added at the deadline, but they didn't fill the most glaring need from the outside, which was an arm. There's still time in August. Will that be their plan? Brewers just finish up a series with the Dodgers. We saw Clayton Kershaw go six, and we know all postseason aspirations, at least on the mound, uh, go through him. What are the plans to keep him fresh the next couple months? 
fresh and healthy and you're thinking about the Nationals still without Steven Strasburg, is there any timetable there on his return? <laughs> we called it not a <laughs> matter Rossi of time on matter the of time corner <laughs> Robert take it away you tonight at PNC Park against the Cardinals he made 17 starts for the Rays this season three and five with a 4-3-1 ERA this will be a second career start against the Cardinals on the mound for St. Louis John Gant pitched pretty well since entering the Cardinals rotation back in June one and two with a 2-6-0 ERA in five starts out to Boston for our showcase game between the Yankees and the Red Sox. Luis Severino and the Yankees looking to rebound after a lopsided loss on Thursday. You can say that again. The Yankees ace has struggled lately. Last four starts one and two with an ERA close to nine. Rick Porcello makes the start for Boston and at Fenway he has a 1-2-9 ERA in seven starts against the Yankees. First pitch right here on the network at 7. And in Los Angeles, the Astros return to Dodger Stadium in a World Series rematch. Justin Verlander takes the mound for Houston, and he is 1-4 with a 3-5-4 ERA in his past eight starts. Alex Wood makes his start for L.A. The left-hander has won his last six decisions. Stark, it is Friday. Good morning to Good you. Good morning. I hope you brought some trivia. Yeah, I did. And I hope we can show it right now. With <laughs> it, You told me it's involving a trade deadline acquisition. Yeah. We're intense, right? We sometimes think we're better than the umpires. We sometimes think we're better than the managers. We can do a better job, uh, you know, than the general manager at the trade. No. Like most of the time, no, we can't. that would never happen. But when you look back at the deadline, give me the general manager that you say nailed it. Okay. Say to me, you know how they were done. It was hat, boom. It was Lance Lynn, <laughs> boom. Yeah. And, and with all the Red Sox and the Dodgers did, it's saying something. So the Yankees, the Red Sox, the Astros, they all got better among other teams. What did their deadline move say about their results in October? Fast forward a couple months. Yeah, I, you know, I guarantee you somebody told me that when the Each other against the other teams. Right. What about the Dodgers that. in the National League? Let's move there, and we didn't touch it yet. I mean, Brian Dozier, Manny Machado first <laughs> and, and foremost, but Brian Dozier already two home runs. Yep. It's like new energy is injected into this lineup. And we were looking at the lineup earlier and we were saying, where's the out? <laughs> One and nine, where's exactly. the out? Can you find it? Series? Uh oh. You're only the third team. See, this in is the a trivia question. It's almost this. Third team in the division play era. That's half a century to go from 10 games. You should have saved it. the other? Jason Stark, you should have saved it. <laughs> Thank you so much. You will join us later and we will reveal the answer to your trivia question.